Long ago, a thick fog rolled into Brendam. The engines couldn't see beyond their buffers. Then, in the fog, one old engine saw a shape. It was tall, like a tower. It turned, and it twisted. It croaked, and it creaked. Percy's eyes were wide with wonder. What was it? They say as how it was the monster of Brendam. But it only comes out when the fog rolls in. <laughs> now, I must hurry. And Salty whirred away to the diesel works. Percy was excited. Do you think we might see the monster of Brendam today, Cranky? Cranky cranked. There's no such thing as the monster of Brendam. Salty's being silly. That made Percy cross. Salty's not being silly. I'm sure there's a monster of Brendam. Fog's rolling in now. I'm sure I will find it. And Percy puffed proudly away. It was foggy. Percy chuffed carefully. He could see Edward. Edward had coal to deliver. Edward, would you like to come and find the monster of Brendam with me? Salty said the monster is tall, like a tower. It turns and it twists. It croaks and it creaks. Bust my buffers. It sounds scary. Then Percy gasped. Fizzling fireboxes. There it is. It's tall like a tower. And very scary. Edward pumped his pistols, and with a whir of his wheels, he whooshed forward, straight into Rocky. Rocky was surprised. He dropped an oil drum right onto Edward's coal sacks. Coal dust flew everywhere. Edward, what are you doing? I'm very sorry, Rocky. We thought you were the monster of Brendam. Because you're tall, like a tower. Don't worry, Edward. I'll go and get help. And Percy chuffed away. Percy steamed slowly to the level crossing. Toby was there. Hello, Percy. I don't like all this fog. I do. I'm looking for the monster of Brendam. Salty said the monster is tall like a tower. It turns and it twists. It croaks and it creaks. Trebling tracks. It sounds scary. <laughs>